Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. It has been a long time since I've actually said that so that feels a little weird but I when you're watching this haven't uploaded for like two and a half weeks which is not something I want to make a habit on my channel. I really want to be consistent but I just wanted to update you kind of like where I've been, what I've been thinking and feeling uh, because I will be uploading Sunday and I just didn't feel like just being gone for two weeks and not explaining what's been going on is a really great idea. So first, I just really wanted to say with everything going on in the world, there's just a lot. And I know that there's a lot of people struggling and hurting right now. Obviously, we're still dealing with the pandemic, but aside from that as well with George Floyd's murder and the Black Lives Matter movement, there is just a lot to think about and there is a lot to learn about. And there's just a lot to process. And I think that as a white person in America, I have been trying to figure out where I fit into all of that. So what can I do to help and what can I do to be an ally and how can I help those who are hurting? And the black people in America are hurting and they are struggling and there are changes that need to be made. I had an entire script typed up on my computer. I wanted to make a video just expressing some of my concern and frustration with some of the things that I had been seeing on social media, some of the trends, some of the comments. Um, and I decided to not do that, not because I don't want to talk about it, not because it's not important, but because I personally have a lot of educating of myself to do and I have a lot to learn and I in no way think that I have all the information or I am the perfect person to come to to find information that is going to inform someone about Black Lives Matter and about the movement in general. So I have decided that instead of making a video, I'm just going to link videos of those who do have a lot of knowledge and wisdom on this topic and do have a lot to teach you. I'm going to leave a lot of resources down below. So I'm going to link some videos, some Instagram posts or accounts down below, and I just really recommend you to look at them and just to make sure you have an open mind with something like this. Obviously, I am a Christian and as a Christian, um, there is an even bigger issue that goes with this and as Christians, a lot of the friends that I've seen who are also Christian, um, I've seen a lot of differing sides to this topic and while I understand that everyone has their own opinion and that everyone has different experiences that lead them to perceive something a certain way, I do know that we all need to be open to listening to those who are hurting, weeping with those who weep, and being willing to research and understand something and realize that maybe the way you have looked at something your entire life isn't correct. Uh, so I would just like to link some resources down below. That's pretty much all I'm going to say about that because, like I said, I am not the person to come to for a bunch of information, but I can be a way to share information from other people who are very knowledgeable and who can really teach you and I want to share that with you. So going off of that, um, the last few weeks along with just being overwhelmed with everything going on in our world and just being heartbroken by all the hurt that I've seen, um, I also have been struggling personally so I did lose a family member a couple weeks ago and it was kind of expected unexpected and it's a, it's a difficult situation. Um, just losing this family member brought up a lot of other things. There's just a lot of um, emotions and things that come up that I needed to deal with with this person passing away. And so uh, that's just been kind of a struggle. And because of that and the world and different other circumstances, I just haven't really felt like myself the last few weeks. And I just needed a little bit of time because I don't ever want to put content out there just for the sake of putting out content and just for the sake of making sure I upload every week. That's just not how I am. And so I only want to put up content when it's something I'm enjoying doing, something that I'm excited and proud to show you guys. So that is why I have waited to upload for a few weeks, but don't worry, this Sunday there will be a new video and it's something that was filmed about a month ago, but I still think it's a good video and I still want to share it with you guys. So look forward to that and then on just to end the video this little update video on a positive note i wanted to say thank you for 100 subscribers i did reach 100 subscribers today so thank you so much that just is a huge milestone it was the first one i was really excited to reach and now we're going for 500 so if you haven't subscribed please do that it'll help me out a lot 
and I will be doing a giveaway soon, um, probably in the next month or so. That will be in a video, so keep your eyes open for that. So like I said, if you aren't subscribed, make sure you do that. If you hit the bell next to the subscribe button also, it will notify you when I do upload and you won't miss that giveaway that is coming in a little bit. So that is my update. Make sure again, please check out resources down below. Please make sure that you are researching and educating and listening to others who you may not agree with right away. I will see you guys in my next video and thank you guys again so much for 100 subscribers and I can't wait to see you next time. Bye.